Before I give you guys my uh, EDC update, I just wanted to go and talk about a couple channels that have uh, just really brought a lot to YouTube and a lot to the community. Um, Apothesis 7 is a great guy, just some outstanding uh, knife reviews, and I've had the pleasure of meeting him in person. Uh, Bankmind80, another good guy, Justin, uh, some outstanding knife reviews. Big Bubba 5037, awesome leather work, another great guy to uh, post some videos on YouTube. I Spy 0099, I'm sure everyone knows him, outstanding at Oakley Reviews. And Guitar Mikey 2, just an all around great guy and lots of different stuff on his channel. Some other outstanding people to check out, Good1975, good good friend, does a lot of shooting, uh, also dabbling in some knife reviews, Mr. Jimbo Fox, a personal friend of mine, which you've seen um, several collaboration videos with, outstanding knife reviews, gun reviews, and gear reviews, PRS Player, um, cool guy I found on YouTube, does some knife modifications or customizations, and really does some outstanding work. The Cajun Blaze, who doesn't know about the Cajun Blaze, just a very cool guy, you, you can't uh, say enough good things about him, and a tactical defender, great, great guy. Some special shout outs to the ladies of YouTube, Valley of Photography does some outstanding work and her videos are just uh, one of the, some of the best on YouTube. Bay of Destiny, newcomer here, does some pretty cool gun videos, definitely check her out. Catabunga, I'm sure everyone knows about, just does some outstanding gear reviews and has some just awesome videos in general. Keterbug15, awesome knife reviews. Roscoe Ba, I'm sure everyone is aware of Max Expedition is her thing and she does an outstanding job. SP Silvgo, Sue, does some knife videos, just outstanding female perspective, as well as Colette or Exolette, um, just all around cool videos, knife throwing and, and all that good stuff. So definitely please check out all those channels if you haven't already. Outstanding content, really provide a lot to the YouTube community and are uh, just, just great channels to watch. How's it going everyone? Today I wanted to give you guys another EDC update. It's been quite some time since I did that and my EDC has changed significantly so I thought that would be an appropriate time. Today my girlfriend and I went to one of Virginia's many beautiful state parks and while we weren't, a lot, weren't able to do an EDC update there just because of the amount of people there walking through the trails, uh, I don't think it would have been appropriate to kind of have all the different stuff out that we typically carry. Uh, so we came back to the house and we're going to be doing it in this lovely kitchen for you. So I'm just going to go through all the items I have on my person and, and share that with you. So first off, just to start off uh, with what's on my body itself, um, my watch, wear it every single day, it's a Luminox 3000 series watch. Uh, I always have my paracord bracelet on me, um, it's actually a gift from my good friend Trevor, um, wear it every single day. Uh, also, Oakley flax jackets, love them. Uh, let's see what else. That's pretty much all that's on my body itself and then inside my pockets. Front left pocket is my phone, Motorola Droid X. Great phone, love it. A little bit big, but um, for you know playing on YouTube and all that kind of stuff, it really is quite nice. Again, left front pocket, also chapstick. Right front pocket, I have my car keys. On the car keys, I have the Mr. Jimbo Fox lanyard, house key, car key, a uh, little Streamlight Nano Stream flashlight, pretty nice little 10 lumen flashlight for uh, how small it is, and then we have the Spyderco bug with some paracord attached on there. Okay, so that's the car keys. Knife for today is the is one you haven't seen, which is the Spyderco Sage 2. Okay, great knife, it's got a lot of use on it. I really put it through its paces, and it's just been outstanding. I love the Sage one, the Sage 2. It isn't any different. All right, left cargo pocket. We have my flashlight, which is Nikkor D11, new from Nikkor, great light, absolutely love it, great ramping feature, and uh, have a little paracord lanyard that came with attached to it, just to make it easy access. And then right cargo pocket, I've started carrying a small multi-tool, I didn't ever carry a large multi-tool on my person, but I found that uh, the more and more I carry this, the more and more I actually use it. And it's just a Leatherman Squirt P4, I've done a review on this, and it's also inside us a little bit a little Leatherman sheath. Um, great little item to carry. Now for my firearm, I've started carrying on body a lot more instead of, you know, like in my Versa pack. Uh, so I do have a new system. 
first off, I'm going to show you the firearm. All right. Today, it's a car CW9. I uh, did some range reports on this. You've already seen videos on it. Uh, a grip and the Crimson Trace laser grip on there. Absolutely love it. Great lightweight, um, very thin firearm. All right. And that's being carried in a crossbreed mini tuck holster. I'll just put it in there to show you guys what it looks like. Alright, so very, very simple. Alright, and then on the left side, carrying a spare magazine. Right, eight rounds. These are spear gold dot 124 grain standard pressure. Above a 5037 here on YouTube. Uh, his company Freestyle Leatherworks. Just great holster, very comfortable. Um, I'll do a review on that later just to show you guys that in more detail. And then finally, in my back right pocket is my wallet. Uh, another item from Christian, um, from Freestyle Leatherworks, it's just a very simple um, two, I guess, two pocket wallet, very thin, very lightweight, cash in the middle, cards and ID on the other two pockets. So just a great wallet, wallet very thin, love it. And that's pretty much my EDC, everything I carry on me. Uh, it may look like a lot, but it hides away pretty nicely. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I wanted to show you my new and improved EDC because it has changed a lot since the last time Keelan asked me to do this. So, first off, I have new sunglasses that Keelan got me for Christmas. They are Oakley Jupiters in this pretty bluish green color. Um, I absolutely love them. I wear them every day and it was a big surprise, so they're definitely worn every day. Um, light. I carry a 4.7s Mini AA. Um, I keep it so I don't have to turn it on every time. I just push it to turn it on, which I think is helpful, you know. I can do all the different modes and everything, so that's fun. Um, knife that I'm carrying today is the Benchmade Mini Gritillion. Um, absolutely love this knife. Um, I carry this one or usually the Spyderco Delica, um, even though that one's a little bit larger, but it seems to fit in a lot of my pants. So either of those. The newest thing in my everyday carry is this new purse. Um, I saw Ophelia Photography talk about it and I absolutely love it because I can fit everything I need which is not much which is you know very minimal so and I also can carry a gun new concept for me so I'll show you what I have. I have my keys attached here which is really nice because I love my carabiner so just my keys. Um, like her, I do can slip my phone in this little pouch right here, and it has Velcro, so. Luckily, because this is phone is really big, which is a Motorola Droid 2, uh, it slides out, um, fits in there, which is really nice. I was kind of hesitant if it was going to fit. Um, in here, the front pocket, I just have some snacks, a snack, and that's where I keep my grocery list. Um, then there's this bigger pocket here which I carry, I have my little purse thing, and then I have a thing of mace, which I actually need to get a new one because it's expired, so I need to get a better, or a new one, not a better one. Um, and here I also have, ooh, can get it out. My Kershaw, um, oh so sweet, got it from Jimbo for Christmas present, and I was told I needed to do a review on it, which is coming eventually. I will get there, I promise Jimbo. So a shout out to you. I will get on it. Um, so I carry that in there too. Um, and it's got a little key fob in here that I can put my keys on, but I just don't do it. It's just easier for me to get to it. So the biggest surprise in here is I'm carrying my SR9C. It's the only gun I have right now, but there will be more in the future. So I'm carrying this one. And I absolutely love it. So thanks for watching my EC update and if you have any questions just let you know. Okay, bye. I find shelter in this way.
this way. Mm-hmm.